They're just gonna wonder why I have a smiley face. And you, I guess. She wrote a smiley face on my thigh. Anyway, what is going on guys? Today we are back and today we are back with another challenge. Me, me versus her. So I've done this challenge before and I made it with my brother and my sister, but I forgot how we did it. So we just went back and watched that video a little bit. And basically you write down stuff that you might have done. Maybe you have not. I'll write down 10, you write down 10. And then at the end we'll be like, you know, we'll find out more about each other and you guys will find out more about us. Even though you probably know a lot about me if you watch my videos. No one knows anything about you because you don't ever talk. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I know everything about you. Everything? Everything. You don't know how much dogs I want. How many dogs do I want when I'm older? <laughs> All of them? I don't know. Five. Three. It's three. Is it three? It's five. Shut up, no it's not. So give us a minute, we're gonna come up with our 10 questions. I don't know how you choose a winner of this game. Like, is it the person who has done the most or has not done the most? I don't know if there's a winner. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, okay. Okay, I have my 10 done. What are you at? Yeah, we'll see you guys in 30 minutes. Know. Okay guys, it was more like 15 minutes, right? Yeah. Yeah. We might be able to choose a winner, like we can guess what the other person will say and then like whoever gets the most guesses, right, wins? No. You just wanna play for fun? Kinda. Okay, fine. No winners, no losers today, except for you. Who's going first? You. You. No, you. I already said you. 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 Never have I ever gotten pulled over. Do we hold up our signs? Oh, shit. <laughs> That's the problem. Uh, <laughs> if this game was called Unfair, you'd win because you don't even have a license yet, even though I let her drive my car a lot. She drove on the way back from Table Rock Lake for like... 45 minutes, I had to edit my video a little bit. You better hope no cops watch this video and then like purposely pull you over because you don't have a license. Never have I ever had a drink of an alcoholic be beverage. Are you <laughs> what? <laughs> Which one are you supposed to put? What do you mean? Are you gonna say I have? I'm gonna say whatever I want. Tell me! Yeah. Are you gonna put I have? The family friendliness is gone. <laughs> Pretty sure every teenager that's like 16 or above has taken one little drink, tongue dip, you know, of an alcoholic beverage or something. Isn't it legal in like Europe, like at our age or something? All I know is that in Europe they have this thing called the Autobahn where there's no speed limit and I dream of going on that. You like this new shirt? Yeah, it has cute. a lot of hair. Yeah, look at the back, look at the back. Pretty cool, huh? Never have I ever kidnapped someone's pet. Dog. I'm not a psycho. She kidnapped my dog Rose before. <laughs> yeah, that was before we were even dating. She literally just went with her friends to my house after she'd been over one time with her friends. And she just walked in and took my dog, put it in her car. And, and she peed on me. Yeah, good. If you ever kidnap my dog again, we're over, by That's the way. No, we would probably still be dating without you kidnapping my dog. Well, I wanted to kidnap your dog because I wanted Rose. <laughs> Next is Black Dog. <laughs> You're not kidnapping Luna. There's no way. I will not let it happen. Never have I ever went 100 miles per hour. Does 90 count? Wait, I drive or you drive? Because I've been in the car with you whenever you went 100. I've never gone 100. 120 maybe. Yes, 150 you maybe. New goals 160. 180. So can I put I have since I've been in the car with you? No. You, Why? You haven't driven. Okay, but when I was driving home, I went 90. That's, That's a giveaway fast. for me. I have an RA, of course. I'm gonna. I've been sitting here this whole freaking video. I put me going 100 on my Snapchat before. Probably a bad idea. Anyway. Yeah. Um, I don't speed. Never have I ever broken a bone. Does a pinky toe count? Is it a bone? I think. Or my collarbone. When you were like three? Yeah. Uh, this should be a who knows who better challenge. Have I ever broken a bone? Did you just say your pinky toe? Yeah. Yes. How'd I break it? Doing a backflip? Trampoline? That's the typical How'd assumption. How'd you break it? I got out of my water bed and it got stuck. Ah! <laughs> And it twisted and it My broke. sister rather pushed me off a little slide. <laughs> Never have I ever made a sibling bleed while fighting them. Nails. <laughs> nails? Oh yeah, girls have nails. My sister used to make my ears bleed. She like dig in, just... Yeah. <laughs> I fought with them a lot, oh but God. once I got, I had a baseball bat, but it was like a Dora baseball bat, and I just went with my brother and I just hit him with it a lot, and then his nose bled, so it was fine. I go like this whenever they won't get off me and they just start bleeding. Like sometimes I do to you. <laughs> Never have I ever been ignored by my boyfriend when he plays Pirates Online. <laughs> it's a fun game! Uh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well Dylan played it at Table Rock and ignored me and he's my Dylan boyfriend. Dylan did not play it. He did play it. No, I he didn't. Yes, he did. He played it for two minutes. He played it. I have been ignored by my boyfriend. Did you just give me a paper cut on my nose? No. It's gonna start bleeding. I know it will. Paris, it was my childhood and I'm just reminiscing, okay, a little bit. I'll get over my addiction to it. I've been playing a lot of Pirates Online recently. Five or six hours a day. <laughs> <laughs> More like five or six hours a night after I film and edit. That's still in a day. Look, man, I'm just trying to go to like Tortuga and loot a little bit so I can level up my part a little 50. Savvy? <laughs> 
Okay, we are going on to question four. Never have I ever cracked my phone screen. I've ruined like seven phones doing that. You're an irresponsible, spoiled brat. I've only broken one phone screen ever and I had a clean streak until a year ago. Tanner Fox was over at my house and we went to the skate park and I tried to do a handstand and my phone fell out of my pocket as I was doing the handstand on the skateboard and it tumbled down the concrete half pipe and it shattered everywhere. I need to tell you my story. I got glass in my thumb too and it hurt. Okay, go ahead. I left it on a car once on the highway. <laughs> <laughs> it got ran over. <laughs> I've done that actually twice, so I never put my phones on cars anymore. Yeah. Because I always leave them on there. And then my they, mom did that. No, I left it on there and it like, it went down the windshield and it just went straight on the road and I cried. I couldn't, it was horrible. I cried once whenever I dropped my iPhone 5 in my pool the second day I got it. Is your phone cracked right now? Nope. Hey, I haven't that. cracked it in a long time. Never have I ever ran over an animal. Okay, she doesn't drive that much though. It's not fair. Of course I have, okay. He ran over a turtle. On the way to Table Rock. We keep bringing up Table Rock. It was like a two day trip and we're like, acting like it was okay, a whole you life. ran over a turtle. I'm sorry. I couldn't swerve. I was going 80 miles an hour. You it wanted me to- It was a little baby. If I would have swerved, we could have died. You, you could have went like, do you think? It was the turtle or us, Paris. I already explained this to you on the road. Dylan <laughs> agreed with me and he said we could just went like that and we wouldn't have died. She hit me for hitting a turtle on accident. He was chilling in the middle of the road. There was like eight of them. I dodged all the other seven. I've never hit a dog or a cat or a deer or anything, okay? I hit a possum once leaving your house. <laughs> I was like, I'm just not gonna move out of the way. People hate them anyway, so I just kind of ran over it. It was in my truck. What if that would have grown up to be a mean turtle? Well, you don't know. What if that turtle came back and like bit you in your sleep? <laughs> Never have I ever blown my money on something stupid. You have not ever? No, I don't have a job. Oh yeah. One time I paid for my own phone. Really? I broke it and my dad said he's not buying me another one because I've already broke like five so I had to pay for my iPhone How'd 4. How'd you pay for it? I just saved up. Good job. High five again. You have to do a face and look at the camera when you high five so I can do an edit. <laughs> no, 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 slower. Oh, my turn. Oh wait, I didn't explain my story. Okay, I go. There was actually one on the way home from the Chicago meet and greet. I gave my brother $50 <clears throat> for a white pair of Apple headphones so I could listen to music on the two hour flight home. But yeah, I really wanted to listen to music and I only brought a headphone with 3.5 millimeter headphone jack that plugs into a computer and not the new iPhone. So I was like, what am I gonna do? So I was like, hey. You, you're talking too much. Okay, can I go now? So yeah, I gave my brother $50 for a pair of headphones that come free with the phone. Worth it. Okay, yeah, go ahead. Never have I ever went a full day without eating. I don't think it's possible. Is this upside down? Yeah, it's upside down. How do you? She never eats. Ever. She had like a bite of a sandwich the whole trip we just went on. Oh, I ate a sandwich on the boat. Oh, wow. You're going to die. <laughs> the least I've ever eaten is when like I really can't eat because my throat hurts really bad or something like that, like a strep throat. And then I just get strawberry banana smoothies from like Dairy Queen and suck on those all day. So. I can't eat a lot in the summer. I can't eat when it's hot. You ever had Doritos and milk in the sun? <gasps> Never have I ever lied to one of my friends. I probably have. I'm pretty sure I've lied to Dylan sometimes, like whenever we were in like 7th or 8th grade, he'd be like, yo bro, you wanna hang out? And I would be like sitting there playing Call of Duty with Quentin, and I'd be like, here, I'll go ask my mom, and I'd be like, nah, I can't. My friends always used to ask me to hang out, and they're like, oh, tell me what your dad said, or send me a picture, and I'd be like, dad, can I hang out with Lexi, and I'm like, send no, and then I'd delete it, and he <laughs> says no, and like, Oh my god, that's funny. I always used to freaking do that. I feel like everybody does that, so I don't feel bad. Sometimes you just need some alone time. For like eight hours to play Pirates Online. Never have I ever, never have I, is that how you say it? Yeah. Never have I ever stood it for 24 hours. That's a common one, moving on. Gosh, could have chose some better ones. You had like, I don't know, 30 minutes to come up with these. It's hard. Never have I ever slept over at a boy's house. <laughs> <laughs> I'm what a did good shot, I'm a good shot. Oh crap, whose house do you sleep over at? Not yours. No, it wasn't mine. People haven't seen you wake up at my house in my videos like eight times. <laughs> She sleeps on the beanbag, okay? <laughs> you do, and so do I. No, you sleep on the beanbag. I sleep on your taco bed. That's true. I actually like the beanbag more. Plus, that one has a bunch of dog pee on it. My dogs go in there and pee on it when I'm gone, I swear. They somehow get in through my bathroom. Never have I ever worn Crocs. <laughs> you were really running out of ideas, weren't you? Never have I ever kissed a girl on the lips. Are you sure? Never kissed. I kissed my mom. You sicko. Okay, your turn. Oh, okay. Uh, this one's the dumb one. This is the dumb one? What was the Crocs one then? It was a dumb one too. Never have I ever screamed during a scary movie. I don't know. Okay, you. yes you have. No, I have yes, not. Yes, you have. You know I hate scary movies. Okay, but you're scared. That's okay. why you scream. So what I do when I go to scary movies in the theater is I sit there and whenever a scary part comes up, I look 
at the side of the wall. Yeah, you know what happens when uh, I look at the side of the wall? I still scream. Never have I ever went a week without showering or close to a week. When was yours? Whenever you go camping and you, you don't feel like showering. I went a week without showering once when I used to play Call of Duty Black Ops 2 every day and I got to the highest rank on zombies and I just really didn't feel the need to get out of my gaming chair. So yeah, I went up to pee sometimes though. Never have I ever gotten stitches. You have not? Really? Oh. You've broken a bone, you haven't got stitches? I thought you had. What, what about that scar on your leg? I, right here. I haven't got stitches on that. You didn't? Bro, I got stitches on this. I think I've said that in videos before. That and that. Uh, How again? Me and my brother were fighting and I jumped off my dad's bed and he pulled on my oh, arm. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The very last question on this list. Never Dude. have I ever... Are you ready for this? Go. Sat down in the shower. Isn't that like basically taking a bath? Sitting down in the bath. No, but like the, the shower is coming out from the top. Sometimes I just sit there whenever I need to shave my legs. I just get down in the shower and shave them. Sometimes I'm sitting in the shower listening to music and I've been in there for 45 minutes and I'm tired of standing. Then I just lay down because I just, yeah. Well, guys, yeah. that is basically it. For, are you going to rip them? How do you know? That is basically it for this challenge video. We didn't know the challenge with Paris. If you guys liked it, leave a thumbs up. And also leave a thumbs up if you've ever sat down in the shower. We all know you have, whether you like to admit it or not. No, leave a thumbs up if you ever worn Crocs. No one will like the video then. <laughs> just, just us. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and thank you guys so much for watching, and don't forget to leave a like and share with your friends if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out! It ain't my fault. It ain't fault.